is that it looks to me like, correct me if I'm wrong, but the, the business as usual scenario you're presenting on here on slide 10, or, or sorry, on slide nine, is assuming that all of the vehicles, all of the zero emissions or electric vehicles that are delivered to Vermont as a result of advanced clean cars to an advanced clean trucks will actually be placed in service, which seems a very, hopefully that ends up happening, but it does not seem like that will just happen business as usual or a matter of course without supporting policies and programs to make sure that all of those vehicles can be purchased and placed in service rather than just delivered. So if you could comment on those two things, those were the questions that immediately came to mind on those slides. I have your hand up. Let me just quickly uh, um, talk about the electrification, which um, as you said, yes, this is an optimistic uh, portrayal in the sense that all delivered uh, vehicles are uptaken. And uh, I think this is somewhat, um, there is a sort of built-in assumption for us as we do our strategies that all the, all the strategies that we are pursuing are going to be um, in order to help make this vision possible. So I think as we do our strategy development, it's almost like, what are all the prerequisites that we need to do to make sure they get delivered? So there's going to be an assumption as we do the modeling that we will utilize whatever um, infrastructure build out and incentives are needed to make that uptake a reality.